For years, we have sounded the alarm about the crisis at our southern border, yet this can no longer be called a crisis. What we face is an existential threat to our nation, and it is a threat enabled by the Biden administration. Since taking office, the Biden administration has flouted and defied countless laws of the United States in order to prop up their blatantly illegal open border policies. Countless officials, including Biden, Vice President Harris, and Secretary of Homeland Security Mayorkas, have violated their oath of office by failing to faithfully discharge the duties of their offices and protect our nation. Under President Biden, 8 million illegal aliens have been stopped at our borders, and over 1.7 million known gotaways have entered the nation, with an untold number of illegal aliens crossing undetected. In total, Biden's border failures have resulted in illegal immigrants' totals that are well over 14 times the entire population of the state of Wyoming. The 94 executive actions taken in President Biden's first 100 days alone have decimated <clears throat> all progress made by the Trump administration to secure our nation, ending the Remain in Mexico program, halting construction on the border wall, and handicapping the ability for federal law enforcement to actually enforce the law. These actions and dozens like them by the Biden administration have deliberately created an environment where the rule of law no longer exists, where fentanyl kills our children and friends, and where no community in America can be considered safe. safe. Our hospitals are incurring literally tens of millions of dollars of uncompensated care, and our farmers are going broke because of the destruction of their crops. I urge my colleagues to vote in favor of H. Resolution 957 and call on the Biden administration to end their dangerous open border policies that place Americans at risk. Thank you, and I yield back.